Hey Oracles, it's Anne, and today, um, <clears throat> I have a reveal from the wonderful An Angela, um, <clears throat> uh, also known as Sparkle Penny Pincher here on YouTube. Um, her and I have been talking a lot lately, and um, I really, she had some really cool hexes and things like that that I saw her do, and her handmade nail art is absolutely cray cray so um i had to get some so i uh kind of went against the whole and supposed to be on a no buy thing from her husband and bought something anyway so um i said here i'm gonna send you 30 bucks send me what you feel equals 30 bucks <laughs> so um she sent me that plus some extras and i do appreciate that um she sent this adorable card with all these cute little stickers over it um there's a really sweet letter in here um, so let me go ahead and get started here. Um, first off, I do have to say she did send some diamond clear hexes at the point, uh, zero six two. As you can see, there's none left. Um, the reason being is that this past weekend, uh, my family and I went to the Renaissance fair here in Nebraska. Um, and my daughter went dressed up as a fairy and she wanted pixie dust. So, I made her some really cute pixie dust and she spread it everywhere on everyone she could possibly find. So <laughs> I'm going to have to probably get some more from you here, Angela. So um, in addition to that, uh, I also got Mint Slush, this beautiful iridescence. It's absolutely gorgeous and it's another translucent color. Also Cherry Slush, again another beautiful translucent color. Picks up this beautiful gold. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, I used some of that in with the clear. And like I said, my daughter went crazy with the pixie and fairy dust everywhere at the Renaissance Fair. Um, and that's where I got my henna done um, in the beginning of the video when my hand was in there. So um, some, she calls it Black Cosmos Iridescent. This is absolutely beautiful. The way it picks up like a midnight blue color. Um, I have an idea for this that I'm going to use it in. Some Lemon Slush, which I absolutely love the color. It's such a nice, light yellow. Again, I have some mixes in mind for this. Um, and let's see here. I know I'm missing a... Gosh darn it. Oh, there it is. Duh. Um, then she sent me some fine iridescence in Sun. And this orange color. Hold on, let me go ahead and... Get in here. Sorry. And coral. Yes. So there are the two colors. Absolutely gorgeous. This this one is showing up really orange on my camera, and it's really not. Um, it is more of a coral coral color. Um, my no cameras can really do glitter justice. It's all about what you see in person, honestly. So when you're buying glitter, keep that in mind. What it may look like. On camera, might be darker or lighter. It might be less shiny because people add effects on when they load their videos. Um, I learned that early on. So keep that in mind. Some Mint Hollow, which I don't have any of. This is absolutely gorgeous. Some Raspberry Gleam. Raspberry Iridescent. And there's a difference. This one pops more of a green and this one pops more of a berry. And they're a little bit different colored. Some uh, marigold yellow. It's absolutely gorgeous. Let me go ahead and get this out here. Some twilight blue. Oh, look at that. This is just with my cam with my phone's flashlight on. So if you're seeing a lot of glare and those little gleams, that's because of my camera. Um... So please keep that in mind. That's why I say it's different. But look at that. It's like a mirror ball. It's absolutely gorgeous. Some root beer. Which is really cool. And it's kind of a, almost a matte. Not really metallic or anything. It's just more of a matte. And that's really neat. Um, we got some glow in the dark moons. Glow in the dark stars. And uh, yellow, neon yellow translucent moons. Um, 
we have some cosmic dust or effect glitter. Um, this in particular, you don't really use in mixes. This is more of something to add on to the nail afterwards. Um, again, I put a, a little bit of this in my daughter's pixie dust because it just added that extra little gleam into it. So it's really gorgeous. I love it. Um, some glow in the dark um, pink pigment, which I don't have any of. Thank you. Uh oh. I'm going to go put that back on here. Okay. And she sent me some of her mixes, so let me just move this out of the way so we can get right into these gorgeous mixes here. Okay. We have Ocean Adventure by Sparkle Penny Pincher. Again, oh, this is so beautiful. I don't know if you guys can see the sparkle that's coming off of this. Absolutely gorgeous. Then we have Kelp Forest. Those two together look really nice. Then Mermaid Cove. Troubled Waters. Spring in Full Swing. Lilac Infestation. Crazy Wildflowers. And last but not least, but Neon Splash. So those are the mixes she sent me. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love them to pieces. And then she sent nail art on top of it. Her handmade nail art. She sent it in this um, container. So as you can see, <laughs> some glow in the dark. Um, we'll start with this one. Um, I just put them on the back of a label for right now, just so I don't lose them and I can kind of keep them together. So we have some flip-flops, some teddy bears. Um, we got some seashells in a couple of different colors, some starfish. We have um, some really cool dolphins in four different sizes, some swimsuits. And again, here's some seashells. Then we have up here are some heart keys, some little bicycles. Some cactus, uh, seahorses, um, this is a ladybug, I believe, if I remember correctly. Some ice cream cones, and these footed bathtubs. OMG, I love some footed bathtubs. So that was really neat. And then last, we have some skeletons, some more ice cream cones, and these awesome cool rosettes that she also sent. So that was everything OMG. Um, and like I said, some of it was um, a thank you gift, and I do appreciate all of it. Um, it is more than what I actually expected, and I, oh, I cannot thank her enough. Um, she has been a cool head and a calm person to talk to about a lot of stuff that's been going on, and it's so nice to, you know, just have someone listen to you. Um, and give you feedback that actually means something and understands what you're going through. So um, <laughs> I cannot thank her enough. So and then uh, Angie did mention Angela. Angie, I don't know what she prefers to be called, but Angela did mention that um, in her latest video that she is working on a special project with Tara um, from or Tara. Sorry, <laughs> uh, lovely Lunilla or. Yeah, I think that's her YouTube handle. Anyway, um, I am also a part of that special project as well as a few other people here. So please keep an eye out for those videos from Tara and Angela. And then um, myself and a few other ladies will be following. Um, so, yeah. But thank you so, so much, Angela. I really do love everything. And I will be definitely ordering from you again. So thank you so, so much again, guys. If you are not subscribed to her, let me grab the cart over here. There is her YouTube handle, Sparkle Penny Pincher. Please go over, subscribe, show her some love, show her some support, see what she's got going on. She does handmade nail art, she does different ideas for swaps, fun things like that. So 
Remember to always like, share, and subscribe. Turn that red button to gray. Make it a great day. And until we meet again, guys, this has been Nail Oracle. Bye.